what are the ways to drive the change empathetically? So I would say just develop empathy. So once you have an empathy, you can take care of the things as you go forward. That's the simple thing. So various, like we teach, we have not yet formally announced that program, but uh, uh, these content are part of our IC Agile, Agile coaching program as well. And there will be a specific program which is coming for a transformation called IC Agile CAT. So that's a, a, a certified Agile uh, a program, transformation program coming in. Now, the, the basic thing is that these programs at a high level or anyone generically can tell you the model. You no, know, these are the things you need to take here. But the real implementation depend upon your own situation, your context, who you are, who are against, like in, in front of you. But in general, one of the model which we promote even in our coaching program as well as in our CAT program is, is called SCARF, which talks about that respect people, give them freedom, relate to them, and then uh, uh, like show them the path forward and so then they will collaborate with you. So following things like not attacking people, empathizing with them, don't give them a just straightforward instruction, but giving them choices helping them to relate to what is happening yeah, helps you to build the overall uh, 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 empathy or a movement for the, the change. So that's what I can say that if you do uh, empathy modeling of your target profile, you create an empathy map of it, you may get a lot of idea because of that empathy map. What could be the concerns, pains and gains? So empathy map, if you Google it, it talks about looking at the person or a persona and thinking of what are the major feelings, pains, gains, options, hearing that person is going through? And when you get into the mindset of that person, you will find out how we should communicate with that particular person.